Welcome back to Morrowind Monday. I'm Nighty, the Black Panther Kitty, and I'll be the host for this episode. Well, as I'm always. And before I start playing, let's start the 30 minute timer for this episode, which roughly tells me when to find a point where we can stop. So, what you see here is the entrance to Mount Kand, where we last totally fucked up our quest. If you remember correctly, if I remember correctly, I haven't played for a good while. Um, we killed an Atronach, which we were supposed to talk to and answer a riddle. So we can't do that now. I'm hoping that they will respawn. So this means we're going to do other things. And since we are somewhere in the wild, let's real quick, this is the correct button, real quick, teleport to the nearest temple. There we go, loading area. You will notice me messing up the buttons as always because it's always such a long time in between recording sessions that I play different games and yeah, it'll be pretty weird. I'm used to open the inventory with a tab key, but if I do that with Morrowind, I mess up all the other buttons. So I have put the inventory or the menu on the middle mouse button. Yeah, I, Maybe I need to remember simply doing this in other games as well, so I get used to having the same controls. I don't know. Uh, on the other hand, uh, it'll be less hilarious, right, if I don't mess up the buttons. So um, that said, I was thinking about heading over and learning some things. So we are now here and I'm going to catch the Silt Strider over to Suran and I'm going to learn some things that we wanted to learn for a long time. So one thing that we had on our to-do list is learn some way to make people like us more and yes, I know I will take lots of fall damage doing that. But on the other hand... You have questions? Uh, Mainly just, um, well, no, actually no. So I'm going to head over to the Silt Strider and try to find a spell or something that makes people like us more because we have lots of to-dos where we couldn't get the people to like us enough. So I'm over to... Suran. Come on. Any second now. Yeah, there we go. So we are here. From here we can head on to Bulmora and if we're there we can train a little bit of speechcraft from Kayas Kasadas. Yes, I did do some Why walk when you can run? fiddling around trying trying things and reading up on things so I wouldn't be completely clueless when I start recording this because I think a clueless panther is a bit boring to watch. So I basically checked where I wanted to go to learn things. Because I don't remember what <laughs> the people that we meet are able to teach us. So we're heading to Kayos Casares, the old skooma head. And have him train. I mean, he's he's our boss, right? He's our boss. We get this is the quest from him, so we need to learn things. Are you here to discuss your order as an IT, or is there something else you want? Well, actually, I want to learn something from you. Let's train a little bit. Ah, well, of speech. What may I do for this? A few times because we have a speechcraft skill, which is very very low. Let's go to 
25 if we can. I want to keep some gold because I want to also learn telekinesis because after we are we trained up a little bit. Yeah, we do have enough of that. So there we go. And now we're going to head over to the major guild and use Bloody the guild wow. to teleport to go to the two other places. I'm a bit what? concerned no. about the um, whenever the game stops for a brief second. Because I always think something's completely gone wrong, but I haven't played the game for a long time, and I, I do remember that we always had some frame drops in Volmora. Do you have something to say, Alfred? There we go. And we are going to meet a good friend. All right, I'm intrigued. Go Ajira, friend. <laughs> good friend. Very good to see you. This is an honor. It's also an honor for me. You know, I'm I'm currently heading over to learn some things. Um, you do you do know that I'm trying to become um, one of the master Sweet mages Spuma. of the of the Telvani house, right? So maybe you want to join me when I when I'm there. Then I mean, look at this. Is this really where you want to be? Well, well met. Let's Greetings. See, we are traveling to Caldera first. Ah, greetings. What shall because we talk about? Because this is where we can get the spell of telekinesis. Do you have something um, to say? My notes say in the castle, which is over here. And then we need to reacquire the Daedra skin, which we were supposed to deliver, where the guard was in the way. So the hope is that we're using the telekinesis spell. I guess it's her. Spells. Uh, telekinesis. Thank you very much. Whatever you're looking for, I'm sure. And the third thing was to learn the spell Charisma, which fortifies our personality. And for that, we're going to head to Aldrun and ask in the temple. Tidings and good wishes to you. And over to the guild travel, mage travel. And then I think for good measure we're going to throw in a few more, uh, a few more speechcraft trainings. I just wanted to make sure that I have enough gold for the for the spells that I wanted to learn. Also, this means that I can use the spell making to all basically alter the spells, or rather, create customized copies. Of them. Because the speech, um, the personality fortification spell, for example, is only needed for two seconds or something. Like as as soon as you click the NPC, the time of the game stops. Person, I think it was him. There he is. Spells, charisma. Let's see about the details. Charisma is for 60 seconds, and this is way too long. So we basically make a spell which fortifies a bigger amount for only like three seconds. Can, that is not enough. We can still try throwing some Telvani bat mask on. And then we should be good to go. Let's head back into the Guild of Mages and use the 
the spellmaker. I actually don't know who here is the spellmaker. Let's try it out. This should be the alchemist. Ah, how quaint. She how is do? just the. I must say, I just find you most person. interesting right now. Please go ahead. Enchanter. I'm waiting. The altar. Quickly, Outlander. I haven't much time. I'm just looking for the spellmaker. Is it the teleport lady? It'll be the last person I talk to, so by default he just sells spells. Ah, friend. He is the spellmaker. Spellmaking. So, fortify attribute, personality, and sell. I know that the spell chance is going down, but that's okay. Because we can train that up again. So let's do this one. Um, charisma boost at one. Thank you very much. And now back to Bamora to learn a bit more speech craft, just to be sure. Oh, the tele... Wrong button again, the telekinesis. Is this usable? 65% chance with no... Yeah, it should be... It should be usable enough. Because currently our fatigue is at zero, so the ch spell chances are lowered anyway. We could also use the opportunity, since we're allowed to sleep in Kaios Kassadis' bed, take the opportunity to take a rest. We are on our feet day and night. Ugh. Come on then, say something or move on. She complains while I am walking away. Yes, I do know that the um, regarding the Twitch chat. I do know that um, you can also bribe people t to make them like you. This is what I did before, um, like in the previous times that I played the game. But I want to try to actually use the the um, persuasion mechanics, the other the other <coughs> parts of it. He's grown a little bit of a stubble, doesn't he? Let's get to. I think we can't get to level 30, can we? Yeah, we can get. No, I'm going to get one more and then. Uh, 500. No, I'm going to leave it at that. Should leave a little cash reserve. Oh, let me check. Maybe I have, I have things to sell, actually. So I can. Can get the last level to get speechcraft up to 30. Air training speechcraft. <laughs> take a uh, take a nap. Just to heal and head back. So those are the three things. Now we just need to reacquire a Daedra skin and sell some uh, stuff. For selling stuff, we are going to. Of course, do that with our friends, our fellow Khajiiti, or well, I'm, I'm a Pantheran, which is a mod race, but I, I personally consider them to just be some kind of Khajiit. Um, to our fellow Khajiit, Ravir the Trader. Ravir, hello, you still look ugly wearing the helm. If you like it, it's uh, your choice. I have some things to 
to sell you. Uh, I think that was the button that I wanted to use. Yep. Now we just go down. There we go. And what say you? Now we do have again now we do have a little reserve of money again which means we can now head on so since I'm lazy I'm going to try and reacquire the Daedra skin not by killing a scam is it a scam I think there's a scam that you kill to get a Daedra skin a scam or a Daedra something like that I'm going to head for an, to an alchemist and just how about this? This is supposed to be a fine alchemist, so... There it is. See, it's very expensive. Let me try to make the price down. No. What very is much. this? We can finally... Give this to Master Orion Intel. Now I remember why the game stalls for a little bit in the playing. It is when it's loading game area. Okay. I should try sitting upright. The well, reason why I'm not here? doing that is because the microphone is a bit far away from me, so I'm what always leaning into find? the microphone, basically. I am traveling to... Uh, I think Cedric Moore is a good place to start. Welcome. What street? I just want to exit here. Thank you. Let's get this over. Let's getting it over it with quickly is rather easy if you just let me pass. So let's collect some things here. I tell you, I'm doing a lot of um, let's playing in English lately. Although it's way easier for me to do this in German. Because I never know what to tell you, like what, what stories to tell in, in English, but in German that's way easier to just, you know, to just talk away. But um, I like games like Morrowind in English more and I don't want to have to translate everything that I'm talking about. So I'm heading over here and taking a ship now. Also, the walking times in this game are, of course, pretty long. Because this game did not yet have... I need to actually check that I go to the correct place. This is Tell Mora is where I want to go, because I want to go up here to tell this. Quickly, Outlander. I haven't much time. Um, My time is precious. So there was so the only quick. ways of quick traveling was what I just did, taking a boat, taking a silt strider, or teleporting, marking and recalling. So you can teleport to one spot that you have marked before. I need to go in the other direction, and you can teleport to the nearest temple shrine and. Imperial Shrine, respectively, using one of the two intervention spells. Now let me bust out my water walking. And just look over the water. 
to where we want to be. And collect these bamboo stalks called marshmallow in this game. I just recently saw a video about um, uh, it's, it's from the series How to Cook That by Anne Reardon. Reardon, Reardon? I don't. I always forget how to pronounce her name. But she made a video about. That's weird. I, I, I said I need to go in the other direction and I went in the wrong. Never mind. This is, is a really confused kitty. I need to go into this direction. I am confused, Kitty. Maybe I should just take the ship over. Well, ship over to the boss. Because I'm too confused to do this manually. Speak, traveler. Take me to Voss. I mean, it's just one gold piece. Not good. Luckily, I'm not. I'm not the doggy. Else, uh, it would, I would even start smelling like like wet dog. Yeah. This game is only a little voice over, so in the later games all the texts are actually fully voiced. This only has the greetings and then it's plain text. Finally out of the rain. I think in order to get upstairs to Master Orion I need to Actually, float up. There's no exit. Hmm. Can't get on the top of the tower. Oh, there is another sheet. I was just. Then I was mixing that up because there is another place where there is, I think it's one, one floor lower, another place where there is um, a Daedra. I think that one is in here. Then I have to float up from the bottom. So it's up there is the master's chambers. Wait for an hour for my fatigue to restore my meditation spell. Greetings. The guy who told me to bring this to the master, but I need to bring it to Orion himself. There is again that guard yes, in the way. What do you want? Yeah. He says he's an officer of the pure law, but 
and he wants me to move along, but I can't move along. So now I'm going to see if I can do if this will work. If telekinesis also lets me interact with people. Yes. No, it seems only with things. Then let me see. This is annoying. Oh. No, that was that was a different quest. That was a different quest. How can I help? Yeah, this this sums up my feelings basically right now. This was a different quest. I just thought um, that I already did this quest, and he had the following quest for me. No, this is a different May I help quest. You? Can I tell if, um, Can I levitate around him? I bet this room doesn't have a second exit. Yeah, it's the only exit is where I came in, so I can't get in here from another side. This guy is... Well, I did save, so maybe I can try taunting him. Yeah, it's supposed to make you angry. I did save, mind you. Yet now it's so low that he doesn't want to kill me anymore. Yeah. Ooh, it worked. Ah. And he doesn't like me at all. This was just a try, so... Okay, so this part hey, does not work, so I learned it. I mean, I could use my spell, my charisma spell now. So I can... Yeah, I should use... The to-do app crashed on my streaming laptop. this again using my charisma spell. Oh, he loves me. If I taunt him. Let's see if this... I think this will not work. I actually never, never did. I never... It's called Black Khajiit. Now we're talking. You in What's up with the game? I'm more I'm more confused about the game hanging so often because Nothing has changed. Actually, it should even be, be even better, and I don't have any restore magicka potion on me. That's the first of things. It's damage, my strength is zero now. Oh, perfect. Let's try that again. Is there something you need? I'm a little 
bit too persistent for my own good, I guess. There we go. Taunting him until he attacks me. I would lose, and that does it. So the thing is, I need him to attack me once out before I can kill him. There is no escape! And I think I'm already so far away from being able to walk again. I guess it's not meant for you to kill them, especially not a level nine. May I help you? Well, okay, I need to figure out a way to get past him. And I don't think he's supposed to stand there. So I could use a command, like a console command to reset him, to make him spawn where he originally is, because I have talked to Master Orion to get the quest. This guy is just standing right in the middle of this. Is so, there something I can do for you? Well, anyway, I got notified that we don't have any time for the episode anymore. So we will see each other next week on Morrowind Monday. Bye bye.